Sometimes you're dead and you don't even know it. <laughs> this second guy, he was shot in the back of the head while running away, but his legs kept pumping for a few more feet before his brain told him, hey buddy, you're dead. So he fell over into the weeds. At least that's what the blood spatters at the scene said. He was shot from far enough away and it was so dark, he couldn't be found, so the killer just left him there. No ID on him. Killers. In the investigation, details matter. Most likely more than one doer. Well, these are my first murders, so please tell me you know who did this. <laughs> mm -mm. What about our first John Doe? Any luck? Nope. He's been harder cracked than a steel walnut. Dental work was inconsistent. Some of it was done in the US and the rest was foreign. And his fingertips were compromised by a dermatitis reaction. So swollen, prints wouldn't come out clean until I drank some of the fluid. We're waiting for the results. What? No, do not. Um, is he new on the force or? No. Well, kind of. First victim was allergic to latex. Killers must have worn some kind of polyvinyl protective suit to keep blood DNA off themselves. The victim grabbed in the struggle, causing his fingertips to swell in a histaminic reaction. His dental works off because he had his teeth fixed wherever he was living at the time. Broke his right arm when he was eight, had it set in Berlin. Had his tonsils taken out at 10 in Seoul. against the stove. Didn't know my mother had just turned it off. That's how my brother got this scar. You tell me right now, what's going on? What was your brother doing in Margrave? I don't know. So it's just a coincidence you and he are passing through the exact same Podunk town at the exact same moment in time. I don't know. When's the last time you saw Joe? A minute ago in the morgue. You being smart with me? I'm being straight with you. Hell, no wonder Sharon left you. You keep my wife's name out of your mouth. No, enough, Reacher. You crossed a line thinly. Let it rest. This man just lost his brother. One question, I want the truth. What are you doing here in Margrave? Blind Blake. You're messing with the wrong man, I'll tell you that right now. I swear I'm gonna find any reason I can to lock you up again. Oh, you wanna get the cuffs on. Okay, this isn't gonna happen. Reacher, sit in the back. Hey, I know you're not the kind of guy to beat up on somebody half your size without good reason. He's giving me a reason. Yeah? Well, I know people. And you've got kind eyes. Do what I say, Reacher. Please. I thinking maybe my brother told me about Blind Blake for a reason. Thinking about him lying in that morgue. Thinking I'm supposed to do something about it. Like what? I guess I'll find everybody responsible. And kill every last one of them.